It was the night before Christmas and all was sound when a trending topic came around. Now Alex stirred as he could not sleep as he was thinking of all the revenue he could reap. He went over to see what could be found. Another one? My parents won't be proud. So, uh, if you live under a rock, you'd probably be thinking, what the hell was that introduction? Well, if you haven't checked the, the time, big man, uh, it's Christmas Day, innit? Merry Christmas. Hopefully you guys are doing well. I mean, I would say not a trending topic, but let's face it, Christmas is quite trendy. I mean, you got people out in the street dressed as Santa Claus. No, you don't. Everybody's indoors eating food. See, I, I mean, I'm a trend, you know, I've had this... This Christmas tree up for a while, you know, I've been getting in the spirit for, for my YouTube videos. They'll forever be dated. You'll forever know that Adam Salah got kicked off a plane and it was quite Christmassy when it happened. Don't you wish I was under your tree this Christmas? <laughs> no. No, you don't. I wish I got a new bloody chair. But I'm sure a lot of you guys got presents, wrote some stuff down that you wanted. Hopefully you did get it. If you didn't... Get a real job or something. I don't fucking know. Fuck, get, get a real fucking job, Alex. Oh, so I hear a family Christmas dinner. Get, get a real job. So maybe you could get a real Christmas tree. Oh, I got a few presents this year, which is nice. Uh, I wasn't totally forgotten. For example, uh, my brother got me uh, a mug, which was uh, nice of him. At least he cares. So yeah, I'm upstairs making YouTube videos when everybody else is downstairs preparing the pigs in blankets. Had to get the word pigs in blankets in there. I think I might put that as my title, just pigs in blankets, you know. Who needs clickbait? Who needs lesbian gay uh, <laughs> when you can have pigs in blankets? That's what people want to click on. That's what people want to see. Merry pigs in blankets. It's more merry to be honest, than Merry Christmas. But in all seriousness, I wanted to actually do a serious video today. Oh, every video you do normally takes a serious turn, Alex. C can't we just have a, a happy day? No, uh, we can't. <laughs> it wasn't meant to sound that depressing. Merry Christmas. I wanted to say a massive thank you. I haven't done a thank you video uh, since 10k, I think, because 10k was a huge number. For me to hit on YouTube. I know I do thank yous at the end of every single video. I thank the Patreons. I thank you guys. I, I, I just say how much I appreciate it. But I honestly just wanted to do a video. Because at this time. I've been watching a lot of people on Twitter. Saying thank you. A lot of friends. And um, it's surreal really. To be where I am at the moment. We're on nearly 40,000 subscribers. Before Christmas. You know. Like on Christmas day. We could be really like a thousand away by the end of recording this video, which is just insane to me. But it's not just that, it's the fact that I'm now in a position where the people who I am friends with, the people I DM'd Merry Christmas to, are people who, at the beginning of the year, I merely was somebody who watched them. Now I've spoken to people who I'm a huge fan of, and uh, it really does quite sum it up for me how far everything has come. And the nice messages I've got from so many people, people who just messaged me, people who have helped me. I can't thank everyone enough individually who has watched this, who I've spoken to in the discords. I want to do a huge thank you to Colossal for picking up my videos in the first place and asking me to help him set that up because that directly led me into all the people I love watching, and I was a huge fan of him, so I can't thank him enough for that. As well as iDubs for luckily seeing my video that I tweeted at him, retweeting at it, and then people just pouring in from that, other people I've been watching on the site since 2010, just subscribing to me and supporting the stuff. It's been an incredible last four months, and to say it was a turnaround is such an understatement. To then have someone like Niall or Pyrocynical offer me a place for this channel to be able to showcase my stuff, uh, to help me out because he really wanted to go the extra mile for me, just out of the kindness of the bloke's heart. It's nice of him and it's nice to be able to call these people genuine friends and I can't thank every single one of you enough for that for putting me in a position where I've been able to 
get myself here. It's so much down to you guys, so much down to all the individuals and individual content creators who I just haven't mentioned. Because there are honestly hundreds of you who have shared my videos, liked my videos, and recommended them to friends, or just generally been supportive, or helped me, or collabed with me on projects. People I have worked with this year who are so talented, I, I can't really thank you guys enough. And uh, it's pretty big for me because of the fact that 2017 is going to be a very huge year for me. I've still got a couple months of college left. I'm uh, going to be getting that out of the way, which will be nice. I'm uh, going to try and smash that so I have a, a backup to YouTube. Because I will be doing one year full time of YouTube minimum. That is the aim. And that's thanks to all these people and all of you and all the people individually who have put me in a position where I could actually pursue my passion. And I don't think people understand how much that means to me because at the beginning of the year, let's just wind it back four months or so, I had a dead channel. Uh, I had a fucking dead mind. I don't want to do anything. Uh, I was pretty sure that everything was fucked 100% and that uh, I was never going to be doing anything that I actually enjoyed uh, or anything at all for that matter. And I was very close to being kicked off a college course. And now I'm in a position where I am doing what I absolutely love. And I'm being supported by people via Patreon. I'm being supported by people in the comments. Likes, subscriptions, views. Incredible how far people have gone for me. And I wanted to do a video dedicated to you guys. So people do know I generally appreciate everything that's been done for me this year. Because uh, it's my dream. And uh, I'm pretty much living it right now. So, thank you very much. I always feel like it's important to let people know that uh, I appreciate what's going on here and appreciate what I get to do. I get to fuck around on the camera, take the piss, and just generally have a good time. And uh, people enjoy it, and for some reason, it supports me. And, uh, I mean, that's, that's, the, that's the end goal always. So, thanks to everybody who individually took a step in pushing my content forward and helping me that way. But I think one thing I should do is set myself an end goal. A goal for the end of 2017. Now the fact that we are steadily approaching 50,000 subscribers, in fact we might even hit it on New Year's, I think that the minimum that we could do in 2017 is 100,000 subscribers. That's a surreal number. Uh, it's incredible to even be able to mention that number in a sentence and say, eh, not that far off. I mean, 50,000 people is 50,000 people, but I've now learned that obviously I shouldn't rule anything out, and there's always a chance to better what you're already doing, no matter how far gone you think you are. I've seen a lot of people on my timeline who seem to be pretty down at the moment, and uh, I know exactly how a lot of you felt, and it's one of those things where I look really happy right now, because I, I am, but... That's mainly because of the fact it was a huge fucking turnaround for me. And I can't thank people enough for that. So, 100,000 subscribers by the end of 2017 would be an incredible goal to hit. And one that, weirdly, I do actually think is relatively achievable. So, <laughs> good luck. <laughs> but yeah, I want to say a Merry Christmas to all the Patreons who have supported me in the month of December as well. Uh, I know a lot of people to unpledge due to the fact that obviously it's Christmas and you got to buy your family stuff. You know, I'm not family, just a nutty lad on the internet. But there's been a huge increase in donations this month, which is something that um, really does show that what I'm doing obviously is enjoyable and the fact that you guys want to support me on that level, going into the fact that I will be going full time soon is Incredible. So a huge thank you to Detection, Stat Track Jack, Samuel, Ditsy Daffy, Summerland, Bobby, Krytosh, Rachel, Joey, JMAA, and Balmary. As well as any other person who is pledged throughout the time of the Patreon being up at the times where I was getting a couple hundred views, the times now where they're pulling thousands. It's always appreciated. And uh, I will never forget you people, so thank you very much. There you go. A bit different from the normal stuff, but I'd just be a real human being on Christmas. I'm not real. The real Alex is way sadder, lonelier too. Well, I, I, I reply that I don't look lonely when I'm sat in a room with a big fucking light in my face, alone, uh, with a mug that literally says, 
I have a twat on it. Okay. Merry Christmas. And thank you for everything you've done for me this year. 2017. Let's hope it's a good one. Peace out, people. Have a good day.